Hey there everyone, this is Alcal playing uh, VLDC X, and uh, today we're starting with Flores Jinx, brought to us by Dark Fepezo. Fipo, I don't know how to pronounce your name, I'm sorry. Nothing important. Dragon coins are there. Forest Jinx, probably gonna be a forest level, but I'm not a professional. I don't know that. Look at that. It says so right there. Forest. Whoa, the, whoa, we got fake moons. We got Donkey Kong music. We got a secret P switch behind this statue. <laughs> it just kinda appeared in my hands one night. Jinx! Alright, so. Jinx is like a curse, it's like bad luck, so four is bad luck. Well, Jungle Hijinx is a name that Rare keeps returning to the bank and, um, and I don't know, it probably means something to someone somewhere. I'm gonna go inside this gray pipe and venture forth. Whoa, check it out, I'm now somewhere, I don't understand. The interior subnarian woods a hand. We got guys bopping everywhere, moving left and right, without hair, they're turtles, that's normal. They're not supposed to have hair at all, they're reptiles, they go in the woods, then they forget their lunch, then they complain loudly to everyone, whether they listen or not, here we go. Check it out, I'm gonna bounce on this guy, and now I'm somewhere, and I'm gonna bounce on that guy. Well, I'm not gonna bounce on that guy in particular, I'm gonna bop the, the music though. Not music, they're question mark, wow, this is like a full on separate little level zone. Check it out, I don't know what, I'm telephone. Can you go on tell? Oh wait, wait, whoa, yeah, whoa, wait, wait, whoa, what, whoa, whoa, yeah. There's a midpoint, so I guess you had no choice to get here, maybe? I don't know, I'm a little confused. Maybe I need to return one day. Check it out, what's that? The front news. You had to power up one day. Uh, check it out, I got the springboard. Don't know what it does, I don't wanna go there. Gonna bop this guy though, and bop that guy, and just keep on bop bo. That's a Charlie in the woods. You don't touch those. Then you go up this, this very muddy looking land though. Here there's land, you can maybe explore. Okay, well there's a Dagadon. How do you get there easily? Well you don't. Eh. Alright, now yeah, okay, so you can go there fairly easily, it turns out. Never mind. I'm speaking nonsense. I'm letting my prison. Ah, I mean, it's a little awkward more than it needs to be. I got a springboard. I can get up here. Wow, double tap. Don't need to set on fire and go on a road trip to Montreal where you forget that you don't own any planted spots of lard. That's probably normal. I'm genuinely curious. Like, I just went in that gray pipe because I was like, hey, let's go in that gray pipe. But the level's not supposed to have two exits, so I'm- I'm- This is my p personal curiosity here about what's going on front side. And like, you're, you go down in the woods otherwise anyways? Let's find out together. It's like, okay. See, I never found that P-switch. P-switch? There ain't no P-switch here. What are you talking about? You, you saw the name of the level. No P-switch here, woods. Alright, we got spikes on the floor. We got spikes in stereo and more. We got lava lotus just pupating around. Wow, well, alright, I guess you got this, which is a lot shorter. And then you get blopped right here, so there we go. There's not two, there's two paths. One exit, two paths. That's fun. Oh man, this is the 50th level I'm playing in this contest. Vacation by Retronom. Vacation's a pretty fun concept. Not so much in video games, but yup, 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 welcome to the blop. All right, well, I mean, I'm, I might not really adhere to anything. I'm on a vocation here. So here we got, know your other left. You never said left before, two eggs at level. I'm gonna do one of them. Hope you don't mind, oh geez. Yeah, vacation in, in abstract color town, huh? Why is this called vacation? Two exit level is a better name. <laughs> like it's not, it's not. All right. I mean, look. I'm digging the style. I just don't. Oh, that's not true. That block there. It looks like a block. It has the shape of a block. It is reminiscent of what used to be a block, but it's not. I don't have a face to ignore. That's good. That's useful. Okay, so I guess the clue is that they're the same color as the line guides? Like, is that really a clue, though? How do you get that coin? It's kinda... 
doing its own thing. Like, it's never over land. That's too dangerous. I'm not getting it. Um, this is, this is the fun part about this content. I just do exactly as much as I want. There's a coin up here. I don't think I didn't notice. Charlie notice Azorus. This is the worst dinosaur I've ever encountered. Whoa, it says VL. Probably says Vlad, Vladimir. No, it says VLDCX. Never would have thought about it. Look at that stone. Okay, just a... But you see, this looks to be like the same color as the line guide, but... Oh, whoops. <laughs> <laughs> there was not a lot of oomph behind that jump. I just did a standstill jump there when obviously you need just a little bit more of a push. Not have an answer. Whoops! Just went way too early. I did not parse those munchers. Thought it was background. Up there. It's, uh, at some point, like shines real bright. Oh. Compared to its neighbors, at least. But I don't know if it's relevant or not. Like I feel like I'm unable to trust anything that could be a color-based hint because I don't know if it's ever actually relevant. These are footballs, by the way. Whoa, football! I got a mushroom in my face, gonna stop it somewhere. Now I don't know where I'm at, but there's not a layer dependent activity. Now we're just done. Whoa, okay, that's not a ghost. It's either a fish or another kind of ghost. Don't be tricked. Don't be fooled. Don't be rendered into a pastry delight, yo. So, okay, there we go. There was a midpoint there. You couldn't see it, but it was there. This platform's all twazzled. That's fun. Well, that fish had fun too. Fun for all, including you. I dodged perfectly that mushroom. Really proud of my abilities there. Really get the show off. Kind of got caught in something. Hey, you know what? It's fine. Um. There we go. I wasn't quite sure what was going on. I'm on a vacation, by the way, inside a tubular light trap zone. So you're gonna do that. It's gonna make that escape. I mean, we're gonna go. Oh, uh, I was lucky there. Like, there's no other words for it. That was just pure old luck. And then there's ice physics for some reason. That's fun. Can I reset? Okay. I was a little worried about this. Of course, now I don't got any hints. Yeah, there's ice physics. But these guys just fall here. It's pretty good. It really feels right at home. Alright, so you're safe here, don't worry. There's a mushroom here, don't worry. There's a fish I just died. Uh, okay, that's just a block. Uh, see, whoa. I knew there was gonna be things like that. Yeah, no, yeah, like... Popping blocks with enemies inside are just happening wherever the game kind of wants it to happen. There's no real tell or anything. Okay, maybe I could have escaped, gone down there and bombed the guy from underneath and I'd have been safe. Maybe. Where am I? Good question. <laughs> what is this load zone? Is there anything about this being a different color? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, that's, that's interesting. Dude! <laughs> I feel like I'm having trouble where- Oh, what? No, that's- <sighs> The- This should be given the same treatment. But like, you just get enemies that fall on you from nowhere though. Like, you cannot react in time. Also, reminder, there's ice physics for no reason. There's no ice physics anywhere else in the level. But here, you enter ice physics country. I don't know, like, you had something cool going on. But this second half is just kind of falling apart. It's just, I... Well, I'm... Whatever. Yeah, but, like, fish is funny and all, but then you get, like, falling Goombas, and it's like, oh... Where is this happening in Wong? Like, this is just plain difficult. Like, it's just... Check it out, I got the sweet Don Maku. Like, here you can bop from here. 
Oh, no, that's not solid! No, that's not... Be that relevant considering how everything's really. <sighs> like, this is some ridiculous. Oh, shoot. Well, I'm on top now. Okay, this is probably a good place to be. I don't really need the platform. I get this coin, I guess, for fun. I mean. Now it is just kind of a drop into stuff here and there, but hey, I didn't get this mushroom for a reason. Uh, I kind of figured this would be a thing. Dang it. Ugh, just getting hurt in the dumbest way. <laughs> right here, right next to the goal orb. Uh, yeah, no, this level has ideas, but I do feel like that second section there, the last part, kind of falls apart because you got like just enemies dropping on you is the pebbles that you find explode above your head enough to tell you where they are like quick enough for you to be able to change your position on a moving icy platform like not gonna lie i feel it was luck when i didn't get hit by them my first cycle through and uh, I don't really know what I think about that. It's not really unfortunate. It it had it had eight ideas, it had direction, but it just kind of fell apart. <laughs>